Hello my lovely art tribe, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hi there, my name is Annie and welcome. Um, so, if you guys have been following me for a little bit, you know that in August, I am going to be at PORCON Live, and I am so excited for that. Now, one of my classes, I am going to be teaching how to make bloom coasters. Now, this is my first try at making them, and of course, as expected, I am going to make some mistakes. Even though the result came out to be pretty cute, it's not exactly what I was going for, but it does remind me of my initial state of when I first started doing resin art. I used to make the alcohol ink coasters that look like petri dishes, so it turned out a little bit like that and a little bit of what I wanted to go for. I wanted those really pretty bloom flowers, but I ended up adding a little bit too much white and saying that I added a little bit too much white is an understand understatement. I added way, 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 way too much. So my white sank, but I think still this is really cute. I think there's a learning curve in art and I really truly believe that there are no mistakes. Art is always beautiful, even if you get a different outcome. Now, I am using here the art resin because that's what we're gonna be using at the uh, convention that I'm gonna be at. So I went ahead, I mixed my resin off camera. I added that, I added a little bit of gold leaf and glitter to the middle. Now for these inks, I'm using the Jacquard products. I'm using a yellow and a brown. I kind of wanted a sunflower effect. So I'm going in, making a little bit of design. Now here, you can see right away that my white is sinking automatically because the yellow is popping up right on top of that white. It's immediately sinking. I knew I already made a mistake here, but everything was already mixed. We were gonna go with it and make the best out of it. So I wanted to try different designs. I've seen people do little dashes, little dots and swirls. So at this point here, you know, I was kind of measuring with my heart and just going I was just going guys so here I just took a little toothpick and swirled that around added little dots here and of course they started sinking right away as well um, I decided to take my toothpick afterwards again and kind of move things around you know yeah I knew I knew at this point it wasn't gonna turn out correct but we were gonna go with it it's you know it's art we're still having fun here it's really fun kind of seeing all those colors mix and move it's very therapeutic you know not everything you make is always going to be perfect and that is absolutely okay so doing that i also learned that doing one coaster at a time would be smart i can definitely pour all the resin the clear resin at the same time but when i am doing the design portion adding the alcohol and send the whites i will be working with one coaster at a time now you're gonna see the reveal at the end of course but today i am going to be practicing this technique more so either tomorrow or the next day you're gonna see an update and here you know you see those cool videos where everyone does these little swirlies the the petals and i'm thinking okay this one's gonna work this one's gonna be really really cool yeah didn't quite work out that way yeah trying to make a little design here as well this one we're just we're, we're having fun okay so automatically here you could see that the white kind of you know all sank to the bottom but i'm not mad at it i'm not mad at it i still think it's super cute i am gonna add a darker background so that the yellows and the browns and the glitters pop up but yeah that's about it um just a reminder for you that you know sometimes projects fail but even if they fail they're so beautiful and you should keep you know just keep creating and keep making art and that's all i got for you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed this you know hope this was relatable and i hope you liked it all right i'll see you guys later bye